Okay, I uh, just figured out how to resolve the uh, design flaw in the Turnigy DB, and the issue was they have these little ball cups at the bottom of each shock, which are really um, just a, a few millimeters too long. And what I did was I happened to have some of these uh, replacement uh, shock uh, balls or uh, mounting balls uh, that go in the bottom of the shock, which are just a tad shorter, and that seemed to do the trick. And uh, these are actually for a Duratrax Evader. And instead of using the uh, ball, um, a ball stud, I had to remove that. Um, I used a three millimeter by twelve millimeter, twelve millimeter long screw um, to be able to do this. So I need four of these to make this work. Four of these shock place, um, shock piece parts, and four sets of screws. Um, I'll go ahead and put a link uh, on this video to these parts for you to order to be able to fix this. Uh, but after doing that, um, this is what it looks like now uh, with the new parts on, and it now it now now bottoms out like like it should. Um, and I also used the outermost uh, mounting position to be able to maximize uh, the uh, the throw, and then on the inside. On the inside of the uh, arm, I went to the outermost port on there. Same thing on the front. I'll go ahead and drop that down, and now it now it bottoms out uh, on the chassis there as well. Um, I use the outermost uh, screw here, and I use the top uh, part of the front to maximize uh, the amount of throw. And that seems to work.